Hello. You got a VR headset? A Legion Go? Let's do PC VR. This is the Oculus Quest 3, but you could use the Quest 2, the Quest 1, and you can do PC VR with either of them, but you need a game and PC. Legion Go is more powerful than Steam Deck, and I have done it on a Steam Deck on a previous video, so we'll have a look at this one. To get started, I'm going to use the Virtual Desktop app. It is a paid app on the Oculus side. It's relatively cheap though, but it cuts out Oculus. It's a lot easier if you haven't got a recommended gaming PC. So you would go on its website and download the Windows app. Also, I would install Steam VR, which is free, onto your Legion Go. I already have Steam VR installed, but if you didn't, you just go on, log into your Steam, and download it. Once both apps are downloaded and installed, open the Virtual Desktop app, and under the Accounts tab, you click on that, and if you had an Oculus Quest, you would just put your user's name under that. On the headset is where you would have to buy the Virtual Desktop app and install it and then open it up and then you'll see it'll connect if you want to see a wi-fi to your legion go on the settings i would set it to potato especially when you're just testing games out so the first game is under potato settings which is the lowest you can go this is beat server it's it isn't actually that bad. It's playable, totally playable. This is the next settings up. It's playable, but I think the potato one is more comfortable. The next game, which is probably one of the hardest graphical demanding PC VR games is Half-Life Alex. Again, this is in potato settings. Playable. Yeah, yes, I'd say yeah, it's probably better than it was on the Steam Deck. The next one is in the low settings. So same game, but just a little bit higher on the settings. Remember, Half-Life Alex is a very demanding game. It's even demanding on most gaming PCs. So this is still doing well for what it is, the Legion Go. This is another bit of Half-Life Alex. Again, this bit on potato settings. Just watching the frame rates. It's, it is playable, this game. If you do own this game, you try it out. It starts to struggle, I would say, when you come off potato settings. Like this is the lower setting. I think this could be a little bit unplayable on this set, especially this game. Tell us what you think in the comments, or if there's any other game you'd like us to try. If you like this video, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you.